So one bearing moves without any friction as you can see, which is really good. However, the other three, despite adjustment and um, lots of pushing backwards and forwards, they tend to stick a bit more. So if all four were like this one, I'd have no problem. The solution, as I've read elsewhere, really is to use a more powerful stepper motor, potentially a NEMA 23 um, and also a more powerful one. Just because it's a 23 just means it's larger, it doesn't actually mean it has more power. had to uh, go in my garage and quickly drill an acrylic ruler just to um, test this with. Um, don't judge me. I need to order some more materials and I will make a proper bed. I was surprised I couldn't find a suitable one on a 3D printer site. Um, yeah, that's the uh, arty shot of my original lead screw and rails. They kind of worked fine with the NEMA 17, much smaller rails. My thinking was that I would get the big SBR 20 rails and make a CNC machine which could mill aluminium. I've now got the choice of whether to stick with my very small design and the NEMA 17 and potentially order another one or two NEMA 17 motors that will work with the Adafruit hat or buy some bigger motors and a CNC control board and really go for it. I just need to check my finances really. <laughs> so you can see a uh, little art shot there really but um, thanks for watching and subscribe and I'll be back very soon.